So um, the war in, in, in between NATO and Russia started because Putin is trying to restore the Soviet Union, correct? Obviously. Um, <laughs> Finally. Thank God. I, I think that it, you know, like Putin's government is still like a capitalistic government and still has, you know, like, like sure. imperialist goals and tendencies in mind. And, and so like, uh, and, but with that being said, like American intervention in the region and that intervention ultimately beginning with like the dissolution of the USSR has like led to these border conflicts, not just in Ukraine and Russia, but also between like Azerbaijan and Armenia. And the United States' role in this conflict is really, really important. And this conflict wouldn't exist without that role. So um, yeah, I guess my perspective is, is that um, I'm not necessarily like, I, I just like, I think the United States is like only goal in this should be to promote peace, should be to promote like, like trying to get some kind of an, an agreement or peace negotiation. Mm -hmm. um, and generally, I believe in the self-determination of peoples, including Eastern Ukrainians. And while they do want to leave Ukraine, from the things that I've seen, at least, it shows that like they'd like to be kind of an independent state or some kind of like intermediary state between mm -hmm. these two and not necessarily a part of either one. And I think that that should be I, that would be the ultimate solution, I guess. But I think that that's very unlikely. Yeah, 